everybody, welcome to the Impressive Channel. Chris Brown opens up about Rihanna in his new documentary movie, Welcome to My Life. Be like a little bit after that VMA performance, I, I just broke it to her and said, hey, I want to marry you, but I want to be real with you. I want to, I want to be honest with you and tell you, you know everything. Now, if you want to know what happened, Chris Brown and Rihanna dated when Chris Brown was at the very pinnacle of his career. After their VMA performance in 2007, Chris Brown wanted to marry Rihanna, and these two were very young. However, Chris Brown did reveal to Rihanna that he was cheating on her with another woman. Chris Brown said in the movie that when they first started dating, Rihanna would question him about having a history with someone he worked with and this was probably allegedly one of his managers or assistants. Her name is Tina Davis, and allegedly this is the person that Rihanna and Chris Brown got in a fight over. Now, I don't know how true that is, but it has been a rumor going around for years, and I think that's deplorable that a grown woman would prey on a teenage boy who doesn't know better, but anyway. He denied they had anything more than a working relationship, but when he realized just how serious he was about Rihanna, he decided to come clean and admit to her that he did have sexual relations with her. After that, Rihanna completely flipped out and this is when their relationship really went sour and it turned toxic because Rihanna couldn't trust Chris Brown and they were constantly fighting. So they stayed together but their relationship wasn't healthy. And in fact, they had a fight over a text that allegedly Tina Davis sent and that is why Chris Brown and Rihanna got in such an intense fight. Rihanna flipped out on Chris Brown and Chris Brown began to beat Rihanna. And that is how that whole situation happened, which is really sad. And years after that happened, Rihanna and Chris Brown still began talking to each other and they were still dating on and off. And this is when Chris Brown was also seeing Karuchi. So he was seeing Karuchi and Rihanna at the same time. But eventually Rihanna left Chris Brown for another man. So she was over him and over his ways. But yeah, I do think that Chris Brown's new movie seems interesting because you get to look into his life and see how he fell from grace and how he managed to keep afloat in his career so i think it's cool and chris brown he's a talented person he has a lot of personal issues i know but you know he's a talented guy and i hope he stays on the right path anyway thank you all so much for watching and i will see you next time bye